this is what I want from you. Many of us are seeing through the psychological operation, the mind virus called fear being spread through the media. We see it being used for many agendas towards a new world order, from military power to forced ID 2020 vaccinations, tagging us like cattle with RFID, with nanotech, biometrics, toxins, and who knows what to moving to a cashless world, to universal basic income, where they can control us through controlling our access to money, to controlling what food we have access to, what things we have access to, limiting our choices completely, to censoring our free speech, removing the truth while they tell lies, inflate the numbers, paying hospitals more for intubation, to videos saying that viruses don't exist being removed, while any theory about where the viruses came from still stands to teaching us to maintain distance, to fear one another, to snitch to the authorities, the cremation of care between us. To you who see, though I cannot make your choices for you, I do want something from you, and you may choose to give it or not. I want you to consider taking that consent you are giving to the systems in place and withdraw it. I want you to welcome the three principles of ethics as the only laws you consent to. If you do, then the measure of something is held to highest standard and not whether it's legal in the paltry ways we see now. We ask first whether something is unethical, and if not, one may not like it, but it's best to let it go. If it is unethical, then we judge it. Evidence is brought forth by those who care and can, and that number may grow little or big, and all who care may decide an ethical solution to the problem of one choosing to behave unethically. Presently, ethics is sinking in the sea of legal. Whereas we know in the now the system is rotten, most of us respond as if legal is the first and only measure. It may be you choosing to recognize that, the legal measure, as an operational element, though it is there to control you. As long as enough of us don't claim we don't recognize legal, don't embrace ethics first, their agenda will march on. I also want you to withdraw your consent from authority. Take your authority over self, your sovereignty, and stand with ethics only. A true sovereign gentle one holds oneself and others to ethical standards. Perhaps you are truly sovereign. I want you to aid those who are being bullied, who have not been unethical, as best you can. Stand up to authority. I want you to consent to a better foundation, vastly better than what we have now, and work as you can 
to share it and build it. A foundation from which a truly free and ethical society will emerge. Where the caring ones are promoted to take care of things. And not the psychopaths, as the present systems do. Government, legal, monetary, all promote psychopaths. A foundation that upholds the foundational rights we all have, but are being forced from by the psychopaths in control. With enough of us armed with ethics and arms, sovereigns all, with rights intact and a plan at hand, we will prevail against this global takeover. But if you choose the chicken's path, you will be serving them, regardless of anything else you choose to do. As long as we give legitimacy, give power to the systems the psychopaths hold us in, there we will stay. If we recognize their systems, we will be their tagged cattle, controlled completely, and 1984 will seem a walk in the park. I want you to make a difference. I want you to help co-create better here on our planet. And so, you may choose. Be a part of the problem recognizing authority, or stand sovereign in the face of totalitarianism. I want you to choose to share this, mirror it, post it on forums, social media, email it, and otherwise share. Yet again I say, choose wisely. Amaterasu Solar, Chill for Humanity, Love Always, Humanity Will Win. <laughs>